I'm sorry to ask again, but do you have time to take me to Samos? Of course, my friend. Thank you. I'm not sure I could make this trip alone. This is it. How does it feel being back? It feels like... Uh, words escape me. That's a first. To my eyes, it's home. The smells and sounds are familiar, but it's been so long. I don't know if I can do this. You've done more difficult things. Challenges we overcome always seem easier when they're behind us. What would you do? Hold my head high, walk with purpose, and push those feelings of doubt aside. You're right. I suppose we should head to my family home first. Lead the way. <sighs> it's so quiet here. Nothing like the rest of the Greek world. Living near the docks was so exciting as a child. How so? There was always a new ship to see, new people to watch, from the sailors, often a new word to learn. <laughs> Most of which got me in trouble. I'm sure your mother remembered those days fondly. I know I do. So many faces I don't recognize. You've been gone a long time. Even so, I was hoping there'd be someone I know. Someone who'd remind me of my life before I left. We've only just arrived. It'll be okay. This is where I called home for most of my childhood. Most? I came to Samos at a young age, but I was born in Aligarnassos. Those are days I'd rather not remember. Mm. It doesn't look like it's changed much in my absence. This pottery looks special. My father always felt art was a great outlet when things seemed overwhelming. One of your toys? It was my brother's. I often hid it when he wouldn't let me play with it. A tablet? Looks like some old writing. The ships never stay for long. Samos is a place people come for a visit, but not to live. Is there something about this place I don't yet see? One of my first writings. I was always restless here. Always wanting to learn more about the world beyond, and the world that was. Herodotus! Mistor! Praise the gods! It's been far too long! It has indeed. You're looking well. As are you, Theodorus. I... I should go. I'm glad you're back. Why doesn't everyone just take a deep breath? How could you say I didn't come back when I'm here, right now? We came as soon as the letter arrived. And... I'm a... She's a friend. Oh! I couldn't stay here. I needed to leave. You... No. At least tell me.
me where they died. We... Give him some time. I'm sure he's just surprised to see you. His eyes showed hatred. He probably missed you. You'll see. It's a bit late for that. I know this wasn't the welcome you were expecting. But perhaps it was the one I deserved. For now, I only want to see where they died. I owe that to them. I'll come with you. I'd like that. If you're ready, we should go. Waiting to face reality will do me no good. this island as well as my own home. Seems like a nice place to grow up. It was. You are going to kill someone. So they were often busy. But it wasn't a life for you. There's only so many ships you can see sail away as a boy. Before you feel the boat to leave as well. is where my parents last stood. Where fate decided to take them from us. I thought I'd write about their history on Samos and all they did one day. But not this soon. I should have been here. Should never have left. There is nothing you could have done. But if I had tried, maybe... Maybe you would have died alongside them. And that would have helped nobody. Perhaps you're right. I want you to remember that while we're on Samos. I'll try. I just wish I could have seen them once more. Do you have a favorite memory of them? I remember when my father taught me to swim. He tossed me off the side of the dock. I thought I was going to drown, but then I saw what I thought was a shark. I flailed my arms and kicked my legs until I made it to shore, only to see it was Theodorus with a bit of rock above his head. <laughs> I still remember the sound of my father's laugh and the warmth of my mother's embrace. Your parents like it on Samos. It was more than just a home to them. I saw how happy this place made them, and only wanted to feel the same somewhere as well. What did your parents think of your writing? They always encouraged it. It helped that Theodoros was talented as well, although he always felt more drawn to poetry. If it weren't for their support, there's a good chance I would have never pursued it. If there's anything you'd like to say about your parents, you should. I always feel more comfortable writing than I do speaking. I'm not going to judge. And I know they wouldn't either. They meant everything to me. They always encouraged me. I knew they'd be happy for me no matter what. Sorry I didn't come back sooner. There was so much I wanted to tell you, to show you. Mother, you were one of the strongest people I knew. You pushed for truth, no matter the obstacle. 
Father, your compassion is something I won't soon forget. You taught me it was okay to feel for myself and for others. Your names and deeds won't be forgotten. <sighs> we should head back. being on Samos. Something is going on. Maybe Theodorus will know. Stay close. Followers of Ares here. I don't understand. The question is whether they came on their own or someone sent them. Neither outcome is favorable for us, nor Samos. Of course. I wonder what my parents would do. Exactly what we're going to do. Protect Samos. I couldn't agree more. Ah, you're back. I hoped you'd set sail already. Now isn't the time. We were just attacked. Gods cursed these warring Greeks. Was it the Athenians or the Spartans this time? Neither. It was a group called the Followers of Eris. Whoever it was, thank the gods you're okay. Have either of you heard of the Followers of Eris? Only in name. Who are they? They only care for one thing. War. And you believe they're here, on Samos? They're the ones who attacked us. Have you noticed anything suspicious lately? Strange ships, docking, groups of people you haven't seen before? No, things have been normal. It's been a welcome change. Something is happening here on Samos. We need answers. She's right. If the followers of Ares are here, there's a reason for it. Then it's another reason for you to go. We'll handle whatever is happening here. This is my home too. I'm not leaving until I get to the bottom of this. If it's not safe, you shouldn't stay. He's plenty safe with me. Of course. Come, mister. If this fool won't heed our warnings, it's not our concern. They weren't much help. Something doesn't add up. How could Theodorus and Mister both know nothing? I think they were keeping something from us. But why? That's what we need to find out. What's next? If they're somewhere on this island, they'd stay away from the city. There was a cave I used to play in as a child. It may be worth looking into. Let's start there. So this is where they've been hiding. You were right to suggest we look here. But they've been dealt with. We still need to find out what they were doing here in the first place. Let's look around. Athenian and Spartan uniforms. They could have the people of Samos believe they were attacking from either side. I didn't take the followers of Ares to be lovers of poetry. They're not. This work... It's awfully close to the style Theodorus uses. Why would his writings be here? I didn't take them for the heirloom type. How did they? That's our family's sigil. They must have stolen it. There's no way they could have found that on their own. It was given to them.
coins aren't like any I've seen before. I have. They're Persian. There's a list of names here. I recognize these names. They're all quite influential on Samos. But Missos is missing. I'm afraid to even say what I think is going on here. This island and these people are yours. Tell me what you're thinking. Persia wants to take control of Samos. It'd be a good staging ground for something greater. You're right. I only wish that was all there is to worry about. What is it? If Persia is involved, they couldn't have done this alone. They would have needed someone here to help them. Someone with ties to the Empire. And influence on Samos, yes. Other than myself, there are only two others who could be responsible for what's going to happen and for what already has. Herodotus. <sighs> With everything we've found, everything you've seen and heard, please, just tell me which of them it is. It's Mistor. He brought the followers of Ares here to help Persia. I was afraid you'd say that, but I know you must be right. What do you want to do now? I need to talk to the others. I don't understand why he'd do this. Rahmi can be a powerful motivator, as can the promise of power. But he already had both of those. I know you want to understand it all, but we don't always get the answers we seek. Why have you not left already? That's enough. Put away your disdain for me for one moment and listen. We found where the followers of Ares were hiding. And we know who they're working for. And who is that? Mistor. He's in league with the Persians to take over Samos. That can't be! We aim to free Samos from control of this war, but we never spoke of giving it to the Persians. Then he kept that part from you. I... I'll find out on my own. Theodoros! I know you care deeply for your brother, but this isn't finished. We tasked ourselves with protecting Samos, and it's not yet safe. We need to go after him. Where to? To find Mistor, and the others too. I guess Mistor knows we're onto him. Where's the others? <laughs> 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 Where would he be? There's a small cove on the east side of the island where ships can dock unseen. We should look there. You should be safe now. Where is Mistor? After he ordered me locked up, he left. Seemed impatient. Oh, Theodorus. It seems you were right. I thought Mistor and I wanted the same thing. But he was just using me. It hurts he did this. I know. I've treated you terribly. You just remind me of everything I didn't get to do, and of the past. But you didn't deserve it. Samos should thank the gods they have someone like you fighting for them. They'll know of all you did here. We may have lost one brother today, but we found each other again. You know what needs to be done now, right? Unfortunately, I do. You can stay behind if you want. 
I can do it myself. No. I need to see him. I need to know why he did this. Okay, okay, you got me. How could you do this? After everything our family did for you. They took you in, and you had them killed. That was an unfortunate accident. I promise you, I weep for their deaths every day. I can't trust anything you say. Why trick Theodorus into helping you? Allies are hard to come by, and Theodorus was more than willing. Tell me what the Persians are planning. Samos would make a good stronghold, don't you think? You betrayed Samos, your family. Not your... everything is black and white. Sometimes, people need others to make the best decision for them. And they're giving me Samos to rule. It doesn't matter now. The followers of Ares working for you are dead. Everyone will know what you did here. I'll make sure of it. Oh, I hope you do. I've always wanted my name to be remembered. However, you may not want to start writing just yet. What do you mean? The ships are already on their way. Let him go. We need to stop the ships. I'll meet you there. Samos is safe. What about Mistor? After his failure, he won't get a second chance. Plus, there's no way he'd stay on Samos now. Theodorus has changed. He is the Theodorus I remembered. He was always willing to admit fault. It's a trait too few people share. Then you believe things will be okay, even if you leave Samos again? Of course. Theodorus has work to do here. And he understands mine is elsewhere. Good. Thank you for everything, Cassandra. Without you, I couldn't have gotten through this. I sometimes feel like we've spent as much time at sea as on land. You may be right. We've traveled a lot together. I think it may be time I set off on my own. Of course. As much as I like you by my side, I can't expect you to stay forever. <laughs> I figured I'd take my leave while you still feel that way. It will feel strange, though. It will take some getting used to. Well, where should I take you? The docks near Athens should do. There are some others I'd like to say goodbye to as well. I'm sure they'll be sorry to see you go. To Athens. I sometimes pinch myself to make sure that I'm awake and that all we went through truly happened. With your writings, it won't soon be forgotten either. The world will be better knowing. My mind is flooded with the memories of all we experienced. Do you have a favorite? How could I possibly decide? You opened my eyes to so much uncovered so many secrets and mysteries that will change the course of the world. Your spear and all it suggests. Atlantis, the cult. None of those things are mine alone to take credit for. You were there through it all. How could I ignore what was so clearly in front of me? You couldn't. Which is why you have as much of a claim to all we did. I wonder what the great Eagle Bearer will remember best from this journey. Our trip to Samos holds a special place in my heart. Mine as well. Have you thought of returning? Not just yet, but I hope my next visit is far more uneventful. <laughs> I don't think you'll have to worry about that. I guess this is it. As much as I'll miss our conversations, this is where our paths diverge. Where is your path taking you now? To Thuri. What's waiting for you there? That's the exciting part. I have no idea. You know what? I'm not sure anyone loves the unknown as much as you. It only stays that way until someone cares enough to make it known. In Thuri, that someone will be me. Will I see you again? 
Our paths may cross once more, and I hope they do. If that comes to pass after all, it likely means something big is following, close behind. Then I hope our adventures are nowhere near complete. I've never been great at saying goodbye. To do so is to impart a sense of finality, and we have no way of knowing if this truly is goodbye. Good luck in your travels, Irovatos. I can't wait to hear what you get yourself into. I'll share my stories with you, so long as you bring some new ones of your own. Haha, <laughs> I can do that.